in a time governed by the elite. Surely it is time for the fat fellow and his friends opposite to make way for others who consider the good of their country and humanity. Where does this little terrier spring from? I believe he's a Yorkshire terrier, my lord. One man took a stand for its people. What? The best fighter in the house and the best speaker. Do you intend to use your voice to praise the lord or change the world? This is for the neck. We understand you're having problems choosing whether to do the work of God or the work of a political activist. We humbly suggest that you can do both. The slave trade has 300 MPs in its pocket, but you could do it. Pitt has asked me to take them on. Slaves, do it. Throw their dirty, filthy ships out of the water. We have no evidence that the Africans themselves have any objection to the trade. They do this to let you know that you no longer belong to God, but to a man. No matter how loud you shout, you will not drown out the voice of the people! People? It seemed that every spring the daffodils came out, every summer the cherries ripened, and every autumn... William Wilberforce would present his bill to the House. After all the petitions, all the speeches and the bills, ships full of human souls in chains sail around the world as cargo! Amazing race, how sweet the From acclaimed director, Michael Apted. You've given your youth and your health for this cause. It's time to let someone else try. Crystal Bay Productions presents... I've seen him sick before. I've never seen him look defeated. The true story of a nation once blind. I was chosen for this task and I failed. Is that the end of your story? And the man who made them see... I'm going to try again. I think you should. Although my memory is fading, I remember two things very clearly. I'm a great sinner and Christ is a great saviour. Amazing Grace, the William Wilberforce story. I once was blind, but now I see. Did I write that? He did. 